Hey what's up everybody, this is the Autistic Gamer and welcome back to some more Heracles Almelo career mode. Now, normally, this day on the screen right now would be one of the biggest days of any career mode out there on YouTube. Look them up. Most of them make a big ass deal out of the transfer window ending. But I don't. Because when I buy players, I buy players and I do it whenever the fuck I want. I don't care if it's the last day, I don't care if it's the first day. This day doesn't do anything special for me, and I don't need new players. And I don't need to lose any. So what I'm gonna do, is skip straight over this day. I know, I'm a straight up savage. In the meantime though, because there are no scouts, I do want to offer people some new contracts. People who I think are gonna be really important this season and the next. Logically, Wegors, he's been good so far, he gets that new contract offer. Belasani, my best player. He's logically going to get a new contract offer. Crucial first team player for him. Pedepesi, Mr. Pussy, who's done well so far as well. Really good on the fence, has scored a goal already. No problem for him to be a crucial player either. Federis and Zomer, I'd like to keep him for one more year. Just because they, they, they are old, but they are still really good. I mean, a six, 67 might not look good, but he is definitely really good. He's got some brilliant shots. His defending could be better, but so far he's not let me down. And he's a legend uh, in this club in real life, so that I see no reason not to keep him. And Zomer also gets... Uh, yeah, Zomer also gets another contract offer for only one more year for me. Because his defense is pretty much good as well so far. Most of them will accept the offer, I'm sure. Accept it, accept it, accept it. But Asani says about that new contract, we're not going to take it. Well, I know how FIFA works. And the second, believe me people, try it for yourself. The second people say, what about that new contract offer? I'm going to look to move away after this contract ends. Just offer them exactly the same amount. And they'll say yes. So far, it has happened all the time. I think there's like one in out of so many fucking... Like one out of ten chance that they'll not accept it. And they'll get mad at you. But in general, they mostly accept it. Oh, see... The second, I, I knew it. I knew the second I said this, that it was not going to work. Normally, when you give them the same sort of contract offer, they just say yes. And they say, oh, I'm sorry, I, 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 I now see the arrow in my waist. I should have just said yes from the get-go. But now this motherfucker has a standoff with me, and he doesn't want to sign a new contract. Well, I'm going to keep trying anyway, because I don't give a shit. But we're playing against AZ at home, though. Slackfair, you might still be saying that you're in great form, and you might have gone up a point. But, mate... Still absolutely shit, and Kada has done better, so he gets the chance. Let's start the game at home against AZ Alkmaar, one of the best teams in in real life uh, in the area of easy, and has the best striker. It's just been called up to the national squad. I think before January, he only had about five goals. Now he's the top scorer with about 20. Explain that. It's brilliant. Absolutely beautiful. How 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 do I mess it up that bad? What? Zomer, I give you a new contract offer, you accept it, and this is what you reward me with. An absolutely horrific display. Could be a yellow card here for that foul. Could be a yellow card. Martin go die in the hole, you stupid bastard. There's not even anywhere near a foul, let alone a yellow card. Oh, oh, get away lucky there. Very lucky. They are the better team so far. I cannot seem to get the ball off my own half. I legitimately, I think, only had the ball for 10% of the time so far. I've get, I'm getting completely dominated. And another shot now. I think it's the fourth or fifth shot for them already. I need to check how many fucking possession do I have. I have 35% possession. Oh, it could be worse. Could be worse. Also, could be way, way better. Even though it's career mode, it could definitely be better. That's the goal. I knew it. It is so deserved. Sadly enough, the, the, the fucking commentator said that they are the least scoring team in the division so far. Sadly enough, though, they do score against me, which is what FIFA do seems to do all the time. When the most scoring of their best defence goes up against the worst attack. The worst attack mostly seems to come out on top because logic. 
that, that's not the 10th chance for him already. I cannot, for the life of me, for the fucking life of me, get a chance or get the ball of my own half. Great ball by the keeper. Once again, not being able to get it out on my own half. Why? Why is there nobody in front making a run? Why is everybody here in the back? And look at this shit. See, I, get, I cannot get the, the ball around more than three times. And you get it back. It's not thanks to them. It's thanks to my fucking players not being able to, to pass the goddamn ball to where I want them to pass the... Look at, look at this, please. <sighs> please, I fucking beg to... God, I don't even believe in motherfucking God. Let me have a break. Let me have one chance. One chance is all I ask, and if I miss that, well, damn, I deserve to lose this game, which I already do, but please, please, for the love of, for the love of all that is fucking holy, why can I not get it out of my own defence, my own half, I should say, I cannot get it past the mid fucking line, because they take it off me so fucking fast, because my players, they don't know how to tackle, they don't know how to dribble, they don't know how to fucking pass, I mean, I don't get a fucking chance. To mother fucking god, can you please, for once, deliver a pass that is somewhere near decent? Ah, oh, brilliant. Oh, br brilliant. Brilliant. Fucking brilliant. You could have grabbed the ball, but no. How about not? How about letting the opponent grab the ball? Seems like a great idea. How have I never thought about it? Oh, wait. You've thought about the entire fucking match because you cannot pass a single fucking ball in the right fucking direction. I'm not even going to try anymore. Score the 3-0. See if I give a shit. Let them score the 3 0. Motherfuckers. Oh, apparently it's gone behind for a corner, because logic! Oh, yeah, oh, okay, that is a corner. Great. I'm sick and tired of. Why have I started another career mode if I get this mad about it? I've got. I'd like I, I wanted to say already, I've gotten three whole chances, and look at this three shots. Yeah, that means I've gotten three whole fucking chances. I legitimately could not get the ball at my own half. I don't know what I did wrong. Passing no matter where I wanted to pass to just didn't work. And it wasn't too thanks to their pressure because they didn't even pressure me. It was because my fucking own players were too lazy. They st just stood there waiting for the ball to arrive. So the second they do pressure, they get the ball back. The passing itself wasn't accurate. The dribbling was absolutely shit. And let me guess, even though we've won three games and drawn one, now thanks to this loss, we're somewhere around the seventh place. Your major contact problem with Belasani. Well, now, after that loss, after you showing absolutely nothing, is not the time to be complaining about not accepting the fucking contract. You better accept it, because I will slice your goddamn head off. A little stupid ass piece of shit. And oh, look. Look against who we have to play after a loss against AZ. Against a direct opponent for the top five. Ajax. Oh, the big chances we'll get in this game. I can already know. I can already taste the chances. Holy shit. We're going to win this game 4-0. No? Really? That's the way you want to start this game. By legitimately stopping and not sticking a goddamn foot out. I put Slackfair on here. And for the first time, will you do something in this career mode? Please, you motherfucking score a goal! Slackfair scores a goal! Slackfair scores a goal! Praise the fucking almighty gods! Slackfair scores a goal! Praise Zeus! Praise Mars! Praise, praise fucking Aphrodite! Motherfucking Slackfair scores a goal! Against Ajax away from home! In a bad nipple form! Brilliant! That's the first, second chance for them and it's a goal? An offside goal? Who's outside then? Oh, I don't care, okay. Came out of nowhere, absolutely out of nowhere. I wasn't even commentating over anything. But it, you know, you know, it just happens. When the player stops to run and somebody else just passes him up. Oh! Once again, out of nowhere, they create chances. Slackfair finally understands that he has to play better and he gets an assist as well. A goal and an assist for Slackfair. That motherfucker finally understands that when you get paid that much, oh, your club that you came from gets paid that much, you ask for more money, you come to your new club, you're one of the best players and you play absolutely shit, you need to play better. And he shows that with a goal and a great assist on Vegas. And it, weirdly enough, it is 2-0 against Ajax. End of the first half and we are, spectacularly enough, 2-0 in front, away from home against Ajax. Goal from Weggars, a goal from Slackfair. And Slackfair also getting the assist on Weggars, which is great stuff. 
No, why did you give it back? Why did you give it back? You just passed it in front of his feet. In all the ways they could get back, logically it has to be from a fail of my own team. A missed dribble, a missed pass, no problem. But this, what is this? You get the, you, 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 you get the ball back. You could have cleared it, and that's your clearance. This it brings them back into the game. It might make them fucking score the 3-2 for all I know. Oh my f what? I don't even know how that happened. It's 3-0. It's 3-0. Motherfucker is 3 0, no, but Brunt scoring is 4th or 5th of the season. I thought here it, it fucked up because it didn't go where I wanted it to go. Then this whole fucking ordeal, and it still ends up in the back of the net. <laughs> Holy shit, I'm, I'm very happy about that. And then GA gets another chance here to get away. Does he score the goal this time? He scores the 4 1. Motherfucker scores the 4 1. I am 4-1 in front against AX in the 90th minute. Once again on the back of a loss. At home, that is, against AZ, where we absolutely were horrible. How one managed to do this, I don't know. But clearly, I don't mind. I love it. Oh my dear lord, it's actually the end of the game as well. Logically, I was going to win, but it finally hits me. I've just beaten AX on Legendary with 4-1. Give me a round of applause, people. I deserve that. Holy shit. Yeah, but we're back into first with that. From sixth to first. Well, fucking kept calling me happy. Great. Slackfair also playing a very good game for the first time. I, I, I think that's where I have to leave it off now. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. It helps me out a lot. Maybe share my channel with your friends and I will see you guys in the next episode. Oh, that's a stupid, stupid try. He completely has the chance of opening up the game with this. They were pretty much dominant. I could not get past them.